What's up, Jobber Alert Nation? I'm your host, Killer Keemstar. Times Person of the Year, one of the most pointless awards in all of humanity. But they keep doing it. It's crazy. It's like, look at me, I'm the Person of the Year. How self-obsessed and obnoxious do you have to be to win this? I know you don't choose blah, 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 blah. But you know what you're going through. You know why we're talking about this. It's that time of year. But I was I was reading through this. Look, look who won Person of the Year in 1938. Adolf Hitler, Joseph Stalin won it the year after. Churchy boy won it. You know, these aren't particularly fucking amazing people. I mean, yeah, I'm sure uh, he's just president. You know, Hitler, obviously, I'm sure you, you've got your pros and cons against the man. However, I'm not sure he was really the person of the year, considering he started a world war. It seems to be a slight uh, defecto problemo. Let's see a bit more recent, though. Oh, who's this? American. Oh, in 1975, American women won. Fuck me. This is like, <laughs> that's like something, for, you know, the uh, the modern day political, uh, what they call the justice warrior movement. You know, it's them lot. American women win. Fuck you guys. Fuck you. It's person. P -p -p person. It was probably man before they, you know, realised, oh shit, we should probably include women in this. Ronald Reagan. I mean, he started a war, didn't he? I'm pretty sure. He won it twice. Git. Deng Xiaoping. Let's go a bit, let's go a bit uh, close. To, oh my God, Donald Tr Donald Trump won it. God. This is just honestly the worst award in the world. If you whip <laughs> Ebola fighters, just Ebola fighters, anyone who fought Ebola, you are the person of the year. Barack Obama. You know what I mean? The protester. Kuckerberg, are you mad? Barax won it twice. You greedy, greedy pig. Vladimir Putin even won it. You. Oh my god, I won. Hell yeah! Oh god, see, it's just cringe, cringe, cringe. Yeah, the American soldiers, well done. Greta Thunberg. You joking? Greta Thunberg won it. For what? She's not done anything. I mean, she might be shouting this, that, and the other from the rooftop saying that global warming is bad. She's not stopped it. She's not cured it. She's not ended it. She's not started world peace. Unlike Kamala Harris. Harris, Harris, Harris. Elon Musk, what a man. What a legend. The spirit of Ukraine. <laughs> Look, war equals bad, we all know this, but the spirit of Ukraine, come on, come on, that's just pathetic. That's an embarrassment to the station. That's an embarrassment to the 300 people who came before. But you know why we're here? Do you know why we're here? Taylor Swift has been put in the same category as Adolf Hitler, Winston Churchill, Ronald Reagan. Taylor Swift named magazine person of the year. Are they the proudest and happiest I've ever felt? Has capped off a stellar 2023 by being named time person of the year. Are we just, you know, the star who whose era tour broke off as unprovoked an inquiry into Ticketmaster. So follow the likes of Barack Obama, Greta Thunberg, Zelensky, Adolf Hitler. They seem to miss that one off. So she won it. Oh, Travis Kelch has become the biggest celebrity couple of the year. What has she done? I I'm sorry, have I missed something? 2023. What 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 has she done? Have I have I missed something? Oh she oh she brought out she brought out a musical. No way. Well, why didn't you give it to her sooner? This is nothing sort of spectacular journey through the diverse musical chapters of one of the world's most celebrity pop icons. The film encapsulates the essence of Taylor's groundbreaking career. You're not on a first name basis, whoever you might be. VJ VJ, that's not real. That's definitely like a manager trying to hype her up. Oh my god. Is that it? She's just released a song. She does that every year. You're all shy. Right. Oh, God. So, the thing is, though, she must know she's going to win it because she's done a photo shoot, right? So, it's not really, like, that much of a surprise. Let's see what she's done. So, she's she's brought out a blockbuster, inverted commas, bro. Blockbuster. What, what the f... Anything's a blockbuster these days. You don't need... A blockbuster was Avengers back in my day. That was a blockbuster. That was a real film. Not watching Taylor Swift pre-recording nonsense on DVD. Oh. Her cover shoot features cameo from Benjamin Button. Oh, no wonder they gave her it. Achieved a kind of nuclear fusion shooting art commerce together release and energy. Way too many words. Just absolute horseshit. They've not actually said what she's done. I'm actually reading this and I can't read. This is really hard for me. It's not, she's done nothing. She's done nothing all year except bring out a fucking DVD. Bro, you might as well give it to fucking anyone. You might as well have given it to the Marvel women because that was a, that was a great success, wasn't it? Oh, bro. She peaked a long time ago. I'm not be funny i mean look at that she looks like part of the dark brotherhood mate like she's gonna come around and assassinate you <gasps> oh my god guys 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 take the swift calendar <laughs> oh my god no wonder i'm gonna get her on 2024 it's gonna be a lead 
boys it's gonna be insane yeah time magazine now, what is time magazine as well it's just for old people person of the year please tell me what she's done she has an extraordinary life but because she's an extraordinary storyteller she's not a storyteller she's a singer you don't tell stories romeo save me tell me tell me how i feel this love is difficult that's not a story bro that's a song it might have a story in it but the story could have been written by a 12 year old it's literally she's just copied romeo and juliet the story that shakespeare made if you're going to give it for, a, for that give it to fucking shakespeare 300 years ago cool fact about shakespeare they actually found cannabis in his pipe you know that the bro got high and wrote romeo and juliet insane oh she's performed with Ken kenny chesney whoever the fuck that the whoever the fuck that is swift has has swift has pretty natural pretty what does that say? Pretty natural finding story of an protagonist who happens not despite challenge but What has she done? She's done nothing. She's accomplished as an artist culturally, critically, and commercially. Fucking hell. So's Mahatma Gandhi, bro. She's one of the biggest names in fucking Hollywood. You know what I mean? Like, what the fuck? As a businesswoman, she's built an empire worth one billion. Fucking bullshit, mate. She's just given it to an accountant and said, Here's me cash, love. Fucking put it where I'll make more cash. You know what I mean? More cash equals more cash. More cash equals more cash. That's all I want. Oh. Oh, she's discussed politics and the weather. Fuck me. No wonder she's won. You know what I mean? She's done nothing, mate. She's brought out a film and gone on tour. People do that every year. Give it to Bruno Mars instead. Give it to Santan Dave. Give it to Eminem. This woman's done nothing, bro. She just wore a blazer and sang about fucking Romeo and Juliet. This is absolute bullshit. No, I know what you're thinking. Why the fuck do you give a shit? No, I don't. I'm just curious just to see what she's done. And so far, I know I'm not the, exactly the best reader, but I understand what words equal. And these words ain't equal in a whole lot of shit, man. Just like all news, the most factually correct and most best place to get your uh, information without ever seeing lies. It smells like bullshit to me. Or any big booty bitches is Twitter. But she's not even trending. Let's find her. Hey, Lur. Taylor, she's trending. Trending like GTA 6. Lucky Taylor. Uh, Taylor Swift. Taylor Swift has such wondrous words to say, and I've loved reading his piece for over a decade. Found him, you know. Fuck off, Tay Tay. This is probably one of the last opportunities as an artist to grasp onto the kind of success, so I am reaching 30. I want to work really hard to decide to tolerate being successful. She's 30. She looks about 50. Bro, she's been around since 2009. Fucking hell. It's a goth punk moment of female rage at being gaslit by an ant. She just talks shit. She's like the whitest chick in the fucking universe, boys. Comes out against Donald Trump. Lucky Donald. Times person... Yeah, bro. Fucking give it to Mr. Beast. He's much better. Locking people in supermarkets for 24 days and giving him a grand. Like, that seems like Taylor Swift. Look, let's let's come to a conclusion. As we can see from the time person of the year, there's been some significant people such as DJ Trump, the protesters, Mark Zuckerberg, um, the whistleblowers. Wow. Whistleblowers. Wow. Rudy Giuliani. Uh, I don't know who you are, mate. Oh, it's to do with 9-11. Shit, I'm a bad guy. Arrest me. Arrest me. Jeff Bezos, who sells your soul. The peacemaker. Oh, bro, the peacemakers, bro. The peacemakers. As you can see, to include Taylor Swift on the likes of this with the women, American women, the middle Americans, JFK, Adolf Hitler, and Wallace Simpson. Sung Mi Ling is just absolutely unacceptable. And I will not stand for it. This Times magazine has fallen. It's stumbled. We've got the likes of all these great people, inverted commas, and now we are on Taylor Swift. Martin Luther King, you know, to even be in the same sentence as that man, to share a name is enough to be a legend. And instead, fucking Taylor Swift, the person who sings a Romeo and Juliet, and, you know, got the highest grossing concert tour of all time. Who the fuck? Fuck cares, bro. Are you actually off to go? Who's off to go watch Taylor Swift? Me!